Hello everyone, this is the online only number 253. This is the ICGA convention auction, and yes, it is an online only sale. People get confused with that, we just wanna make sure it's online only. Bring your computers if you're coming to the convention. The uh, laptops, whatever. Um, the sale is Saturday, July 20th. Again, it's on Saturday, July 20th at 9.30 a.m. It is the Bob and Shirley Patterson Collection. We're going to do lots number, this is the fourth video, lots 151 to 200. I'm sure you know that's Eastern time. Do you hear my wife? <laughs> she just said, uh, by the way, that is Eastern time because we are in Indiana. We are in Mil uh, uh, Middlebury, Indiana, and that is on Eastern time. So the 930 is Eastern time, not Central time, not it's. So it'll be 9.30 Eastern, 8.30 Central, 7.30 Mountain, 6.30 West. Okay. 151. I'll have to remind everybody on the rest of these too, right, Jan? You'll hear from her over there. She's in here today, so it's, she drives us nuts. Okay. <laughs> okay, here's the Emu Bowl. Uh, this one here is a rare version, and it's beautiful. It's in aqua. Rare color. This is the large size version. Now here we have another one in purple. Now this one has a small little nick on the edge. It's right there. It's very small, but we want you to see it. But it's a very nice bowl. It's a beauty. Then you have the little sauce. Emu again in purple. Okay, rustic funeral vase. Now, this is a little different than most rustic funeral vases. This one has the plunger base. They are very, very hard to find in marigold with the plunger base, and this is a great one. This thing's absolutely fabulous. Great piece. Hearts and flowers, ruffled compote, aqua opal. This thing's pastel, and it is beautiful. 1911 Birmingham Age Herald. Cla uh, what does it say? Season's Greetings, doesn't it? Yep. Yeah. Yep. There's the ruffled version. Really nice bowl. The building sits nice on that. Yeah, it does. It's perfectly squared. Yep. Here's a peacock and grape spatula footed ruffled bowl in red. Roslyn, ruffled sauce, Millersburg, satin, very nice. This is a nice sauce. I like this piece. Border plants, hand grip, dome-footed bowl. Look at the uh, stretchy iridescence. Uh, yeah, it's a hand grip plate. Sorry about that. Fabulous. Look at this thing. Great piece. Three-in-one edge vintage. This is the nine inch bowl in aqua opal, tough color. Double stem rose, dome footed, ruffled bowl. This is the deep ruffle. Celeste blue, again, a lot of stretchy iridescence. Here's a nice one. Gewurz Brothers advertising plate. That is a really pretty plate, folks. There is a small chip on the base. It is right there. I think you can see that pretty easily. Yep. Okay, you got it? Okay, this is a uh, sapphire bushel basket. Look at the iridescence on this one. Mostly sapphire ones really lack that iridescence on the outside, and this one does not. It's beautiful. One of the better ones you'll find. Yep. And a great butterscotch bushel basket. This is really a nice one. I remember when Bob bought this. Here is the Cleveland Memorial Ashtray in Amethyst. Really beautiful. Now, this is the one that they polished the base off, okay? You can kind of see that it's flattened out. It's not supposed to be that way, but all of it's there in the face, so it's a great, great piece. Here's a beauty. Mikado Compote in blue. Just a stunner. Fantastic. 
Aurora Pearls, decorated art glass brides bowl, polished panel, decorated both sides, and this is in red, by the way. Really great piece. Rosettes, footed ruffled bowl in purple, and it's beautiful. Great piece. Stippled three fruits, spatula footed ruffled bowl in aqua opal. It's a beauty. And then a stippled one in ice green, or is this lime, lime green it looks like to me. Now there is a little bit of epoxy on the toe of this one. Uh, do you remember where it was? I think it's in this grouping right here. No, do we have the black light somewhere? We can show it easier. Jan, the black light over there? Jan's here. So it's she on that table. It's on that table over there. My beautiful bride is coming to do that. I have to say something nice that I picked on her. So there it is. You see it right there? Yep. Okay. Good Thank you, dear. Okay, and here is a it's pearlized. pearlized stippled three fruits bowl. Just notice right there, there's a manufacturer separation there. We're going to point that out. Um, but it's iridized, rare piece. Rare bowl here. This is a Northwood stipple raise. This is a deep bowl in ice blue. Now this one here has been sold... I think three times I sold it in Bob Patterson's first sale. It went to somebody, I believe it was Fred Roke. I sold it in Fred Roke's auction. I believe that's right, not sure. Bob Patterson bought it back and now I'm selling it again for him. Uh, there's not many of these out here. There's really only two of them. So um, I think there's uh, that I've seen, I've seen two. So rare bowl, great piece. Ice blue, stippled, Northwood stipple race. This might even be rarer. I'm not sure. People may have to educate me on this one. If they have one, let me know. This is a blue one. Uh, I think this is pretty hard to get. Carolina Dogwood. This is about as nice as these marigold on moonstone pieces look. I mean, look how pretty that is. Just a beauty. That's a milk glass. Is that milk glass? Yeah, on milk glass. Yep. I, did I say moonstone? I'm yeah. sorry. It's on milk glass. Yes. Here's a uh, aqua opal drapery rose bowl. No, this thing actually kind of leans a little bit to the lime green. It's not lime green, but it leans that way. Here's a Knights Templar dandelion mug in ice green. You see the Knights Templar mark? Tough piece. Illinois Soldiers and Sailors, 7-inch plate, 8-inch plate in blue. Here's a stipple grape and cable pie crust edge bowl with a rib back in ice blue. Very nice one. Right behind it is a really nice aqua opal one. Lots of opal, pastel. Really, look at that opal. It goes down almost inch and a half. Really great. Ten mums, three and one edge bowl in green. Really a beauty. Wow. That's what great Millersburg radium looks like. It's a little sauce, strawberry wreath. Really great little sauce. Amazing thing, not only is the green one great, but his amethyst one is great too. <laughs> Look at that. It is really beautiful. I'm going to go around the rustic vase here. Dragon and Lotus, three and one edge bowl, lime green opal. This is a beauty. Absolutely wonderful. Okay, here's a great one. Garden Path Variant Chop Plate in purple. It's absolutely super. This uh, came out of the Don Clark collection. It's the one that has just a little bit of mold roughness around the bottom. It's 
all the way around pretty much. It's, it's just rough around the bottom. Um, not a big deal. Great piece. Great novelty here is your dog ashtray. Uh, right along here somewhere. Oh, Do you remember? Okay. Oh, yeah. It's right by the, the cigarette holder there. Got it? Okay. Here is a fabulous. This, this is about as good as these get. Look at this tree trunk funeral vase in purple. Unbelievable. Even the inside is nice. Top to bottom. Yeah, this is a great one. Absolutely a great one. Okay, floral and optic. Deep brown bowl. Red, really nice. Here's a tough piece. It's uh, heavy web. No, yeah, heavy web. Square shape. Peach opal. Jockey Club advertising ruffle bowl. Really a nice example there. Fenton Grape and Cable, seven inch bowl in red. Here's a Dugan Cherries, round or ice cream shape. This one has the beads on the top edge in purple. This thing is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Art and vine plate in blue. Oh, dandy. And this came out of the Wilcox collection, so. Hard to take a photo. Kale's got some. Kale has known for buying beautiful stuff. and it's iridescence, whether yeah. it's. And beautiful stuff is the hardest for us to photograph. That's why we do these videos, is you can tend to see the iridescence much better on the video. So here's the town pump, and this is one of the nicer town pumps around. There's iridescence top to bottom. Look at this fancy full bowl. This thing is just beautiful. Just a stunner. And then here's a peach opal one, and it's very nice for them. Isn't this lovely? Don't sing, Jim. Auctioneers can't sing. Here's a lovely bowl in green, deep brown. Okay, here's a fantastic hearts and flowers bowl, pie crust edge. This thing is just stunning. And it's in purple. A lot of people would think that's blue, but it's purple. It'd be nice if it was blue. Mm -hmm. Here is a Lattison Point set of footed ruffled bowl in ice blue, beautiful iridescence, and I felt it as we were. There's just a tiniest little nick on a point. It's not bad. Must not be too bad. No, it takes me a couple of rounds to find it. I would assume it's down here somewhere because that's where the sticker was. But Well, I got a photo of it. We got a photo of it online, so... So, yep. It's very small, I'll tell you that. Here's the blue one that's just a stunner. Just great color to this thing. And dogwood spray, dome-footed ruffled bowl in purple. I'd call that beautiful. Look at that. The Dugan in this sale is amazing. And this, of course, come out of the Morgan collection. You know, Dugan collectors, they know their color. Well, that's the end of the fourth video of the ICGA online only auction, number 253. This, of course, is the Bob and Shirley Patterson collection on Saturday, July 20th at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Thank you.